Hi, I'm Willie. I'm Mike. I'm Kyle. And I'm Tyler. And we're Kyle Brown from the Noonday Drivers. Yes, so, we are. Hey. What's up? <laughs> that is true. Um, and it is Monday. Dun, dun, dun. Um, do you know Which therefore means it is release day eve. Woo woo! Yeah. So pretty know you counting down. But yeah, it's Monday, so our record releases tomorrow. Um, and it will be on our website, kylebryantmusic.com. Check it, it out. It will be um, buy it. on iTunes, Amazon. Check it out. Buy it. Whatever else you buy music from, it will be there. But uh, online. Buy it. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, feel free to go out and get it however you <laughs> buy it however you want to. <laughs> but uh, we would love it if you would buy it from our website. It helps us out the most that way. And um, maybe a little more personal, maybe. Yeah. Maybe, maybe not. What's but, up? You know. We appreciate it either way. But so it's day four, Both. and uh, Both. which means that we're talking about the fourth track on the CD, which is called Hello September. Or any other month that we. <laughs> yeah, any month that. <laughs> Hello October. October. <laughs> Good to see you. It's been a while. It's been a while. Um, but really, it is called Hello September. <laughs> and uh, probably not the most peppy Monday song, so sorry about that, but uh, maybe either way. You'll like it. But before we get into the depths of this song, meaning wise, do you guys have anything to say musically about this one? Just slow jam. Yeah, it is a slow jam. Uh, you know, we started this one just, Kyle had the idea on acoustic, and we just kind of, again, it was another one that was almost a no brainer to write because it was just pretty much formed in itself. Uh, you know, the thing I think that really adds to this song though uh, is the little subtle changes that we did make in the studio mm -hmm. and the strings we had in the studio. Oh, I yeah, think the yeah. strings, oh, strings overall took it from here to like up here. I know you can't see it on the camera, but it's up here. Really above the camera. It's above the camera. Yeah. Took it to the limit. To the limit. To the limit. One more time. Is that a song? But it's the Eagles. Oh, it's the Eagles. <laughs> Out of my Eagles loop. Uh, yeah, but we love the strings on it. Uh, that was a fun touch. That uh, we had a a friend of a friend from Boston, or from Berkeley, city of Boston, fast Berkeley grad. Yeah, he uh, added some of that. So we love it. Adds some uh, cool textures that we uh, haven't had before. Mixes it up. But um, you guys have anything else to say? Yeah. Uh, I think this song for me uh, was was probably. Um, one of the easier songs to play and record in the studio, and not because it's it's a, I guess not a very complicated song. It's just it's very it flows and it, it kind of speaks for itself and allows you to to really get lost in the music and um, just enjoy it in a, in a lot of different way from Dying to Live and then the more upbeat song uh, for the road. Um, but it's one of those that really, like I said, it just allows you to to, to lose yourself as a musician and when you're playing it. So it was a lot of fun. As Eminem said, only get one shot. Lose not yourself miss this in the music. Uh, this is nothing like an Eminem. Sorry, guys. It's probably really. We're not, not a terrible. Band. Band. <laughs> yeah, we're not that kind of band at all. Uh, well, I can't rap. Uh, BS. <laughs> but uh, writing wise, for me with this one, uh, it's actually a really weird song, writing wise, because I usually don't write a song unless I have some kind of music to go with it already, like a guitar part, piano part, band, like full band deal. Uh, but with this one, I literally wrote it um, at my job. Like I drive around a lot in a company vehicle um, to do stuff and I literally was driving around and the melody came to my head and uh, I probably wrote most of the chorus just driving around, just singing it, um, which probably looked really weird driving <laughs> down the road in like hindsight, but uh, anyway, I was. And so I came home and uh, picked up my guitar. After work, I didn't immediately leave work. Came home, picked up my guitar, or did I? <laughs> came home, picked up my guitar, and uh, kind of I put the the melody and the lyrics to the music, uh, which is different for me. But uh, I kind of like how it turned out. Uh, but as far as meaning wise, it's pretty self-explanatory. But uh, I was kind of going through a lot of different stuff in my life at that point, confusion wise with uh, with life. This is kind of a song of me kind of expressing to myself even, you know, what was going on inside of me. And uh, I think the biggest thing for this one for me 
was that just the fact that so many times people my age and you know in the even high school, college, even past that, even just in life in general, we're always so uh, caught up in what's next. Like when you're in high school, you're caught up in graduating high school and moving on to college or a job or whatever. If you're in college, you're caught up graduating. You know, um, if you're out of college, you might be caught up to get a better job or get married or something. You know, you're always looking toward the next step, and we're always wanting to move toward that. And uh, I see that in my life a lot. And this song is kind of a challenge because I was looking at that and saying, you know, it's it's not about always the next step. It's about being present where you're at. And, uh, and counting the blessings that you have where you're at and not always be like, oh, I can't wait until this happens. Because that may not ha ever happen and even when it does, honestly, if you still have that mindset, you'll just be looking to whatever next step you can come up with. And uh, and so with the course where it says, um, why am I moving from scene to scene and what am I hoping to find, you know. I'm not always, my hope is not in what's coming next. My hope and um, my focus is in the here and now. And uh, yeah, so that's kind of the general theme of the song. And uh, it was a fun one to write. And uh, yeah, that's all I have to say with that. About that. Um, you guys have any comments? Check out the out. strings. He loves the strings. He loves them. Uh, <laughs> yeah, um, anyway. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That was a deeply moving statement. Yeah. Tyler, from born, born anew in your statement. Anyway, well that's the fourth song, uh, and so that means tomorrow, in theory at midnight, uh, the new EP will be ready to go. You can buy it. And so, uh, yet again, I know I've said this a bazillion times, but um, tomorrow, please, uh, if you have enjoyed what we've been uh, talking about and what we've been letting you listen to, please go to our website, kylebryantmusic.com, and I click on the download link on the box. It will take you to uh, the location to uh, buy the new EP, uh, five songs, and it will be $5. And uh, get it there. And if you are really a big iTunes person or Amazon, it will be there too. But if you if you would, our website would be awesome. But get it there and uh, jam it out. Leave us some love. Yeah, leave us some love on uh, Facebook, uh, Twitter. We have a Twitter if you want to do that. It's KBND Music. Uh, which illustrate that at the end of the video, get an app, the squiggly thing. That'll be there. But yeah, um, and if you like what you hear, uh, feel free to tell your friends through Facebook, Twitter, pass it on, whatever else. Spread the word. Uh, we would love to come that Yeah, we would love to help because we love doing this and uh, we'd love to do it more. And uh, really, we can only do that if you guys let us, you know, because uh, we can play music at our friend's house all day long. But so we have people to play it for, kind of, it says jamming out. So, anyway, uh, if you uh, like the song from today, feel free to talk about it at the comment section below, or leave a comment below. This isn't YouTube, so, comment below. Yeah, and so, oh yeah, you guys have a great Monday, and we will see you guys for the last song tomorrow, tomorrow, which is also release day. So, check out 12. Be excited. Alright, guys. Deuces. Yeah.